Scott McTominay scored twice in second half stoppage time as Manchester United recorded a 2 to 1 win over Brentford in the Premier League on Saturday afternoon. Matthias Jensen sent Brentford ahead in the 26th minute of the contest, and the Bees led deep into stoppage time at Old Trafford, with the home side staring at a third successive home loss in all competitions. McTominay leveled the scores in the third minute of additional time at the end of the 90, though before he netted again in the 97th minute to secure a huge victory for the 20-time English champions. The result has left the Red Devils in ninth position in the table on 12 points, four points behind fourth-placed Liverpool, while Brentford sit down in 14th on seven points. Brentford had the game's first-half chance in the fifth minute when Aaron Hickey found space on the edge of the box, but his effort was just over the crossbar. Man United gained control of the ball in the period that followed, but the Red Devils were finding it difficult to carve out openings, with Rasmus Hoagland struggling for support. Brentford made the breakthrough in the 26th minute of the contest, and it was another poor goal to concede from Man United's point of view, as Johan Wissa was allowed to drive into the box before rebounding the ball off Viktor Lindelov, and it then fell for Jansen, who found a route into the back of the net. Andre Onana was again beaten far too easily, with the Man United goalkeeper allowing the ball to go under his grasp despite seemingly being in a position to save it. Marcus Rashford brought a smart save from Brentford goalkeeper Thomas Strakosha in the 37th minute, before Brian Mumo curled one just wide of the post on the other end. Wissa headed a Bruno Fernandes free kick over his own crossbar shortly before the interval before Brentford had the final chance of the first period, with Christopher Ager's header dropping just wide of the post. Substitute Christian Eriksen brought a smart save from Strakosha in the 53rd minute, before Diogo Delot cleared one off the line down the other end, with Ager flicking towards the near post. Rashford fired one wide of the post in the 56th minute, before Delot floated one over the crossbar just past the hour with Man United desperately looking to level the scores. Hoagland struck into the side netting in the 64th minute, and Strakosha was then called into action to keep out a strike from Fernandes, who had struck from distance. Alejandro Garnacho fired one over the crossbar in the 77th minute, before Onina made a smart save down the other end to tip a Neil Mope effort over his goal. Man United thought that they had leveled the scores in the final exchanges through an own goal. But Anthony Marshall was penalised for an offside, with Brentford remaining in the lead. The Red Devils managed to equalise in the third minute of added time at the end of the 90, with McTominay picking out the bottom corner with a clever effort after the ball had bounced back to him following some poor defending. McTominay then won it for the Red Devils in the 97th minute with a powerful header from a Harry Maguire flick as the pressure was eased on head coach Eric Ten Hag courtesy of a huge result, which made it four wins and four defeats for the club from eight league games this season.